Bri, what's the best part about playing with Linda Stepney? Um, I feel like she's a great athlete and she's always running, pushing the ball up the floor and she's easy to communicate with, talk to. Um, I feel like she's, she's just a great player overall. Did you, from, from the minute you came here and started playing with her, could you see that she was somebody that you were going to enjoy playing with? Yeah, I feel like she's a great leader on and off the court. Um, I feel like when I first came here, we, we, we connected, we bonded, like, as soon as I got here. And on the court, it was, it was the same way. Is that nice tonight to not have to play 40 minutes and actually get to sit for a little while? Yeah, it actually was nice. I'm so used to playing 40 minutes. I was just sitting on the bench, just kind of like just sitting there and just watching, kind of like bored. But it was a good feeling not to play 40 minutes tonight. Do you ever get on Linda about shooting more? Um, yeah, in practice I do it. Like, cause in practice she shoots a lot. I feel like she shoots more in practice than she does in games. But okay. I mean, I feel like it's just who she is. Like, and we're trying to change that this year. Like, mm -hmm. compared compared to last year too. Like her shooting the ball more and stuff. Like, in practice I feel like she does it more. But we're just trying to get her doing in games too. Because for this team, what, what Lene seems to be developing into, I mean, she had a double-double tonight, 10 points, 12 rebounds. Obviously, when you get into the Big 12, she's somebody that's going to be really key to this team. Um, yeah, I feel like she's been working hard in practice lately. And this past summer, she's been working a lot. I feel like she's gotten better. Like She hasn't played basketball in a couple of years. And it's like her, really her first year back really playing, playing. So I feel like she's getting better day by day in practice. And she's just taking it step by step in games. Bria, defensively, um, I mean, five steals. It seemed like you were pretty active on defense. Not like this is different than opposing night, but um, I guess tell me defensively, is it kind of starting to click more for you um, in terms of getting on, on track with, with offense? Um, yeah, I would say for come last year, Coach Carey used to tell me I'm used to not being aggressive enough on defense. So this year, I feel like I turned it up some more, being more aggressive, like just getting, the, getting my deflections on the ball, just being more active and just running out on the break. Um, Linda Fee and me just, just running and just having deflections, hands in the passing lanes. Guarding the opposing team's best players, that's something that you you know want, uh, a role you want on this team? Um, I really don't mind it. I feel like it's a challenge, but at the same time, it's something that he depends on me to do. So I'm just going there and do what he wants me to do. Walk us through that assist behind the back early in the game. <laughs> Um, Coach Carey told me he would have took me out if I didn't make the pass complete. Um, I don't know. I just was reading the defense. I didn't want to take a, I didn't want to force a charge like I usually do. Um, and I just saw my other teammate there, so I just threw it behind my back. And luckily, she called it and made the layup. Anything else? Yeah, Coach Carey told me that I would have took me out if I didn't make the pass complete. Um, I don't know. I just was reading the defense. I didn't want to take a, I didn't want to force a charge like I usually do. Um, and I just saw my other teammate there, so I just threw it behind my back. And luckily, she called it and made the layup.